I'm gonna dance with them. I'm gonna dance Kinky Boots choreography from Broadway. We're gonna do some like hip hop. There's so many styles in New York now. So to go to a day of auditions of, of Broadway shows, you need to bring your ballet shoes and bring your tap shoes and bring all those things and be ready for all those styles. We just touch on all these different things and give them a little flavor of different styles. And then I want to hear their songs and hear what they, because I run auditions as well in New York for shows. The question is how do I stand out amongst thousands of people trying to do this? And for me, the truth is just being authentic to yourself, knowing the material you're singing, knowing you can sing the song you're about to sing. And kids, it's such a confidence game because kids are so can be so insecure and they're at those like formative ages where they're like, I don't know if people like me, I don't know if I'm good. And the arts is one, the performing arts is one place where they put their phones down and it's them in front of Pete FaceTime moments and they have to like convey feeling, convey passion, convey happy, sad, dark, all these different things. And so it's fun to see kids at different ages come out of their shells. I mean, I did the show for three years and there's days I'm just exhausted, um, but that's the power of theater, to see these people change and see them be affected by the message that we're conveying. And I've done shows that the audiences aren't that big and they're just trying to sell and you're up there bored and opening nights I've had just tears, tears, tears and the, the journey it takes. I mean, it's a lot of money and producers and costumes and like to, to get a Broadway show up on its feet in New York City is a feet in and of itself. So to be a part of that struggle and then finally see it pay off, finally see people applaud, buy tickets and write reviews and all that, it's a, it's a very exciting business to be a part of.